What's up everyone, Take Down here, welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be talking about common issues with the PlayStation 5 and how to fix them. Let's get right into this. So for the first issue is if the PlayStation 5 will not turn on. If you press the power button on your PlayStation 5 and it won't turn on, don't panic. Here is what you should do. First, check the power cord and make sure it's securely plugged in. Next, if you checked that, try plugging it in to a different power outlet. Maybe there was an issue with that power outlet that you were using. Next, if that didn't work, try using a completely different power cable with your PlayStation 5. There could be damage to the one you were using that you cannot see. And the last thing to try if your PlayStation 5 won't turn on is a hard reset. Simply hold down the power button for at least 10 seconds. This will do a hard power reset and hopefully that will fix your issue and you can turn on your PlayStation 5. The second common issue is that your PlayStation 5 is loud or overheating. If your PlayStation 5 is making too much noise or seems to be overheating, try these steps. First, make sure that your PlayStation 5 has enough ventilation and is not in an enclosed space. Next, clean out the air vents with compressed air or even with a vacuum to remove any dust buildup. You can even take off the... You can take off the white covers on your PlayStation 5 to clean out even more dust around the fan and that will not void any of your warranty. Next, make sure your PlayStation 5 is not in a high temperature environment or in direct sunlight. And lastly, you can try reducing the graphics settings in games. And the third and final common issue with the PlayStation 5 we're going to be talking about today is PlayStation 5 freezes and crashes. If your PlayStation 5 freezes or crashes during gameplay, try these steps. Close any other apps or games that are running in the background. Next, try deleting any unnecessary game data or save files. Also, make sure that your PlayStation 5 is up to date. And lastly, you can try rebuilding the database by going into safe mode, and hopefully that will fix the issue for you. Hope you guys enjoyed today's video going over some of the most common issues with the PlayStation 5 and also how to fix them. If this helped you in any way, leave a like, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Please take care. Peace.